Yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead, man, and attempt to make me a grill. I have a piece that's coming from um, from New, e New Mexico. It's a uh, wing with the Chevy emblem in the middle. So I'm gonna give it a shot, man. I got this mesh. It came in. Uh, this mesh was like 170 shipped. And of course, I ordered a, another grill. This is the original grill. I've seen how some of those guys are making it, as you see. I have it out of the box, Chevy. There goes the, the old grill right there. The old insert. So, man, we're gonna give this thing a shot, man. Uh, it's the same type of mesh that Tierra uses, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, but yeah, man. Yeah, it ain't gonna hurt to give it a shot and uh, I'll show y'all that emblem that I got coming in with the wing. So what I'm about to do, I'm about to get ready to um, mark it off so I can know exactly where to cut it. So, cause this is like, this piece was 170 something dollars so I don't wanna mess it up. So the cut gotta be uh, right. So let's get ready to cut that, cut this out, man, and give it a shot, man. And, uh, see how it turn out. See how it turn out. Let's make our own grill. All right, YouTube. I went on here and got me a template cut out for it. Got me a template cut out for it. It ain't perfect, but it's good enough so I can get uh, so I can get ready to. Um, trace it out on the mesh so I can move this out the way move this out the way and I can put this down so I can cut around it see I ain't gonna I'm gonna yeah about that much cause see all of that right there gotta be folded to go in the inside of the grill yeah see all that gotta be folded so only thing I'm really gonna cut is right here. I'm gonna cut right here and cut up to there. All of this already cut for me. So we're gonna get this a shot. See how it turned out? I had to go to Home Depot and get one of these uh, wire mesh benders to bend the mesh. So you're gonna clamp that down on the mesh and you're gonna bend it. And I need to get a marker so I can mark it. So I can mark off where I need to bend it. So yeah, let's get this a shot. Now, as you can see, I think I got it all uh, cut out pretty good. I'm gonna take this marker and I'm gonna go ahead and mark in the middle section. That's where I wanna bend it. That's where my bend is gonna be. So I'm gonna take this marker and mark it so I can know exactly where my bend will be. All right, as you can see, man, I needed somewhere to, uh, Put this um, put the mesh so I can get my bend on. You see, I got it cut out. This part is right here is gonna go up under, so it can go inside of the old grill. So I laid it right here so I can take the tool. I can take this tool and bend it down. And I got the line right on the concrete, so when it bend, it can't do nothing but form like in the concrete. So. Let's see how this turn out with it holding down like that. Okay, I see how I gotta do it. I I gotta cut I gotta cut slits in it so it can bend easy for me. So I cut slits in it like I cut a slit right there. I got a slit cut right there so it bent easy. That slit right there. So let me cut me a couple slits so it can bend easy. Yeah, as you can see, them slits help bend it down. See how it's going down. Yep. Stay tuned. All 
All right, YouTube, here is the grill. First time doing it. Man, that stuff was like a hundred and seventy something dollars, man. So I wanted to make sure I did it right. Uh, my first time doing it, man, it was kind of hard to be in. But um, it's okay, man, for my first time doing it. So I know the next time when I do it, I can get everything situated, you know. See how it's looking there a little bit. But, uh, I just need to understand how to cut it, man. That's the only thing, but other than that, man, it really ain't bad. I'm just waiting on the wing to come in. I'm gonna go get the wing chrome plated. And uh, this car gonna look pretty good, man. Uh, I'm gonna see how I look in the daytime, far off, and uh, see if I really like it, man. See how, if you can see them corners and, and uh, see if the corners look bad in the daytime. If that's the case, then I'm gonna go ahead and just, you know, of course, order a grill, man, order a Tierra, but it's just a simple fact, man. I like to say that I did it, man. That's 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 my thing, man. It's, it's not about if you're being cheap or got the money to, or don't got the money to go get something. It's just sometimes you wanna do it yourself. You know what I mean? So, I enjoy doing it myself, so I'm just waiting on my wing to put in the middle, and I think it's gonna uh, it's gonna hit pretty good. So I'm gonna wait on this wing to come in. Today the uh, the wing came in. That goes in the center of the grill, and here's the wing that I was telling y'all about that I gotta go get chrome plated. See, it sits just like that in the middle. It sits like that in the middle. And it gives you an idea on how it's gonna turn out. I could paint it, but I'm gonna go ahead and just go ahead and chrome plate it. But y'all get the idea. And I'll let you know who I got that from. But he got the Chevy, uh, emblem in the middle got the wings you see I got the Chevy emblem right there so that was a nice look so I'm gonna go ahead and center this with it raw and let y'all see how it look with it raw on there before I take it to get chrome plated or like I said I may end up painting you never know so I don't know yet we'll see yeah y'all see it man I got it on there like I said, it's kind of custom made, so it ain't sitting as flush as I want it to sit to the grill, but it's all right, though. Saved a lot of money, and it look, it look good, you ask me. But uh, what's crazy is, if y'all looking at it, you can see, you can see like a hint of gold. Can y'all see like a hint of gold? Right there, you can see it, but guess what? That's not even gold. That's actually rust because this is a raw metal piece that I gotta get done. So that's actually rust, man. And and what's crazy is now I got an idea on how to do it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna wrap or get it uh, chrome or uh, gold plated this second piece. See that second piece? I might um, gold plate this second piece or I might wrap it. And the front piece, which is this piece, I might, um, Chrome plate, but uh, man, I, I, I like it. I like it. There's so many different ways I can play with this grill, wrapping it, painting it, gold plating it, chrome plating it. There's so many ways I can play with it. So anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, end this video, man. Uh, that's how I made the grill. And uh, if you want to make your own, you know, you can take these steps that I did, or you can, um, you know take it and add something on it or whatever, but this is what I came up with, YouTube. That's what I came up with. I had an extra grill on standby just in case I messed it up too bad and I need to put a grill back on there, but we good to go.